painting permission walls for a start the walls are going to last they're not going to get cleaned off you know they'll be there for probably for years and years to come maybe forever and people will see it and people will know it's you because you could admit it. it's something you've done legally so i think yeah legal walls are a good thing to get into if you get into it and get good at it you can earn a good wage off of it there's all kinds of projects that like kids can be involved in um, quite often done through schools i mean there's a big sort of movement towards that now um, like this, basically. This was done with um, some of the youth them from uh, Fairfield. It's all their own work, you know? Um, I just was just there to make sure everything was like sharp and clean and crisp, and if they were like, yeah, I want to learn this technique, or yeah, I want this to do that, I'd show them the technique to do it or whatever. I, I had, like, no guidance in it, no realisation of what I was doing. I didn't really realise it was that illegal or that there was legal places that I could do it. I mean, Probably the best thing to do is, you know, to if you see an area that you think needs like maybe a lick of paint, it's been sort of a problem before, you write yourself a proposal, you know, to say like, yeah, you know, this area could do with a mural and everything. And we're just painting this wall by our school like today. I'm just painting the wall down here which was covered in tags before. Well, it did look pretty horrible with the wall just covered in like kids' tags and stuff. Yeah, like when people would like need to like express their feelings, that like, you can do whatever you want free. Yeah, make sure you think about it. Like, what you're gonna do? You're gonna do it. Uh alternating letters like that purple and that purple, or are you going to do a two-colour fade? No, are you going to... No. Yeah, what do you reckon? Well, see, I, what, what I'll do... I might as well just put it in, but I might as well just make it just go up like that. Well, like, in the first place, I wasn't, I wasn't very good at painting, and he kind of really taught me, like, the basics, and I just got a lot better quickly, like, just after that. It's sort of yeah, harder you start I've trying got, to, to do all the technical yeah, stuff before you've got the core letters. Yeah. My letters are quite simple, but it's like a sort of word style, but like, like a simple word style. But when the letters have got a sick style to them, it just, I don't know, it adds something to it. Once we get like some of their like outlines in there, man, we'll look about integrating like extra little bits. Hopefully I could do it professionally. Yeah, that'll be fun. You can like turn up with something that you really like. You can really, you can remember, you know, like you could, you could take pictures of it, and other people will see it, and it's, it's not going to get cleaned off for a long time, and it will look a lot better as well. Like all of this wall's going to be looking good, so hopefully the right will just leave like um, bombers or whatever. But yeah, we're just doing like taking a lot of time on just stuff to make it look a lot better. I think it's like. Um... It's bright, it, it catches your eye. It just makes the envi environment seem like a lot nicer. If someone's interested in graft, this is, this is definitely the way to go. If you've got the urge to paint, just come down to Dean Lane and do a, a legal bit of graffiti. Because then you don't, it's not, you're not feeling like you don't have to watch your back every two seconds, you don't have to turn around and look over your shoulder. So I come and paint this piece today and I don't have to worry about it. But it's worked out for the best because now I can just come, I can chill out and paint, innit? I don't have to be worried about it. Just do what I want to do, come down there, I'll go out with Rich or whatever and just have a good time doing it instead of having to worry about getting caught and all that stuff. It's entirely possible to do work in public to express yourselves, but to do it in a way that has a quality to it. Unfortunately, I, I didn't really have that guidance. If I'd seen a DVD like this when I was in school, I might have uh, changed my views and not gone down the path I had. So hopefully I can change that for a few other people. So it's just good to have like, um, you know, just, just to get involved in these projects and that sort of, you know, enables you to learn and, and build your skills and your techniques 
and you know, as something that you can use in your portfolio, even when you're older, and say, yeah, I was involved in this project, I helped run this thing. You just gotta work hard at it, though. Like, if you're if you're if you're not a toy, you'll be dedicated to it. Like, you actually people will know who you are. You'll get respect from other writers. So, if I was you, I would stick to legal walls. It's not really about doing illegal graffiti in this world. Do you know what I mean? Keep it legal. Keep the peace.